Alright, how's it going everyone? I'm Aaron Nick and welcome back to Final Fantasy Platinum Demo. So I am it's actually a different day. I um I went to bed last night, I had to restart this and it doesn't save, so I don't think this demo is actually as long as the last one. Um so what I did just now is I had to start over from the beginning and work my way back to this point. It really wasn't a big deal. And also, I make sh made sure I got every single one of the crystals, so I'm continuing on now. Um, there wasn't really anything else. There was one thing that I'll be playing at the end, because I actually saved the clip. Uh, I saw another summon when I was in uh, the forest area, so I'll be playing that at the end. So that's a little sneak peek for if you want to skip ahead or just wait till then. But it was really cool. I didn't have anything to say because I obviously wasn't recording at the time, really. I just saved the clip. But it was it was really cool and interesting. Let's see. What's the next area going to be like? So we're at the forest. We had in his house being really small. Now we're in some cityscape with some rain. Bit. Wow. We're looking for a long hallway. That would be the end of your dream. Okay, so the end of the dream is a long hallway. Let's look for it together. Uh, this game is absolutely beautiful. I um, I hate myself for not really have talking about the, for not talking about that last night. Uh, but yeah, this game is completely beautiful. I like that those boxes you can break right there. I like that some stuff is interactable. Uh, it's really a good sign for the for overall game. Oh, now it's bright and sunny. Any day. Um, oh, so one thing I know is that weather is supposed to affect magic. So if it's raining, your lightning magic is going to be stronger. But there's also the risk of hitting your teammate. Okay, it's rain down. Uh, let's see. This is an awesome city. So this is this looks like the water city that they showed all Leviathan in. Time sped up, so it's going to change tonight. Oh, there's some enemies over there. Which, the fighting in this really doesn't matter as much. I realize that when enemies hit me, I lose a gem. Oh, shit. Oh, he's just a big, uh... Just a big goblin guy. Oh, I can't really see now. That was camera kind of working against me right there, but... It's alright. It can't all 100% perfect. That's... Okay, that's one thing so far. The... The combat does feel more fluid. Uh, I can attest to that. It feels like it flows a lot better. Oh, what's this? Transform. Oh, I'm in. I'm the the big thing now. So okay. So what those platforms do is they actually change you into some of the enemies. Uh, so I can run around as this enemy, but couldn't climb these stairs apparently. Oh, because it locks it off. Okay. Gift. What do I get now? Raindrops. Okay, so that's probably water. Um, so I need to try fire and water. So I'll try those now. So I'll try uh, try thunder first. Okay, so when you're casting magic, you're completely still, and that kind of shows you the range that it's gonna hit in. Wow. That was pretty cool. That was pretty damn cool. Alright, I gotta try main drops, which who knows how cool that would be. Why did I get hit? Did I get hit? Who knows? Alright, so raindrops next. Let's do it. So, even though it's one enemy. Ah, uh, raindrops. <laughs> What if I just walked out of the way, but that's still cool. I like that. So, that, I mean, that's an interesting effect for water. Uh, it looked more neon-y than water, but still, I I think that looked really cool. Especially since I'm just using um, fireworks in this. I think there's a lot that can be put in the main game taken from this. Uh, I was thinking on it, even the fact that, like, what I really want out of full game is the ability to build up your character something stirs in the dream oh that's a, that's usually a summon 
remember when that dad, your dad bought you the ball you wanted? Made him so happy. What you wanted most was for him to do it. Dad should go. Um, I want something to be in those boxes. Um. Yeah, uh, looting and stuff. But what, but what I really want is just the, like the beginning to be like a very, very weak Noctis. Like maybe you can only equip one weapon at a time. Then by the very end of it, you, you can equip all your weapons. So it, even like the moment you unlock your last weapon slot, the to equip feels good. Like it feels great that you get another weapon slot. Oh, there's okay, and the camera is still fairly close to Noctis. Um, you are able to see a little bit more. They did work on that, I believe, uh, but it's still like a little too close to you. So some enemies can get you from behind, and you might have to watch out for like some of the bigger enemies in the game. Meteor rain. Ooh, that one. Keep the gift. What was that one, though? Oh, an enemy approaches. Okay, so... That was, like, a scary face, so I think I might have, like, unlocked one of the tougher enemies. Or it might just summon these enemies back so you can continue to fight them. Um, I'm going to try Meteor Rain, because I am interested in what Meteor... Yeah! Here we are. Boom. Whoa. That is just everywhere. Okay, so that's like the ultimate attack of this demo, it seems. That just killed everything in an instant. I know the other magic attacks would seem powerful, but that just killed everything in mere seconds. All right, I've already been down there. There's one more of uh, these question marks I can step on. Okay, that's the long hallway, so that ends the demo. I got more fireworks. Ah, this must be the place. But I don't want to end it necessarily yet, because I want to try and go down here and see if there's anything else. Oh, so that question mark just refilled my magic, I think. Yep, more raindrops. This city looked great though. This is really what they needed like after the last couple games is open cities like this. What am I gonna fight? Oh, there we go. So that is actually a lot of guys. I might wanna use uh Well I threw that in the completely wrong way, but doesn't matter, cause Meteor Rain bitch! How many do I have? I have eight more. So I can eight insta kill people. Alright. I don't want to be that powerful in the main game, but. Okay, maybe. Okay, I want to try. I want to try using this. Oh, I, I thought that was the lightning attack still. Or not, not lightning, I thought it was raindrop still. I wanted to see if that would actually work. And if you could kind of use that to like the tactical advantage. Because that seems like an attack that would be great to like block off enemies. And I haven't got an upgraded hammer yet. I was expecting to, but have not yet. Alright, I think that's just about it for this area. I think I explored just about every corner of this map. So let's go to the hallway and see what happens. Or let's just turn into another animal real quick. There we are. Giraffe. Giraffe attack. <laughs> it's it's so silly and kind of stupid. He's turned into this big like giraffe monster. Alright. Let's find out. Hallway. Up ahead is where your dream ends. The one place you feel safest. I've always been a real sleepyhead. He did sleep a lot. Like, um, that, like that's kind of what they're pointing out. Maybe your dream will end with this bed. 
see, find you pretty impressive. So is that the end of the, everything in the demo? You ready? The end is just up ahead. He keeps asking me. Hopefully there's like another trailer or something. Because that's what they did in uh, End of Dust Guys. They showed like a quick little like teaser to some of the stuff to come. Loading, loading, loading. I hope there's not a ton of loading screens. Like, I mean, you kind of can't, you can't really escape loading screens, but games are getting a little bit better about it. All right. It's a Citadel. Thank you. Something doesn't feel right. So I think that... Well, this is obviously the stairs that they showed the very first trailer of the game. Oh, there's stuff to do here. It's your home and all, but is it truly your safe place? Iron Giant. I'm going to kick his ass for hitting Carbuncle. Leave my little friend alone. Don't be afraid. I'll protect you. Through your darkest wow. dreams. This one will protect you through your darkest dreams. But remember, Noct. In the world of your dreams, you are king. I'm not afraid. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Oh, and I actually get like fire and stuff now. So this is like the actual gameplay of the real game now. Fire? Yeah! So it's a level 3 Iron Giant. Can I use these? Oh, well, those are just my speed of time. I was wondering if they give me like magic. Uh, do I have different weapons? No, just the, just what they give me. Okay, so fire uses MP now, and I can't. Maybe I only had one. Wow. All right. Well, question mark. What's question mark? Oh, MP fully restored. Oh, so now, okay, so now I can use the Warp Strike too. I completely forgot about Warp Strike so far because it hasn't been in the demo. Wow, this is, this is much more free flow. Oh, well, I'm getting only a little bit, but... But... But I dodged that one. Alright, well, I gotta get out of this spot. Is that... Oh, you're able to use those to... So you're supposed to use that. Is what I think was supposed to happen. Alright. Oh? Alright, so the combat is gonna take a little while to get used to. But, I do enjoy this. Come on! Alright, so I'm in the trouble situation, but there's no way to heal me, I don't believe. Unless... Oh! Ruby Light! He heals me! Warp, warp point lots of appeared. Oh! Okay, so that's... Now I can warp there. Take a breather of my magic control. How's it going, everyone? Oh, he can knock me down. Dad, I didn't know he could knock me down. Uh, wait, why is it? I didn't see him like. I have no clue why there's damage multiplier, but this one. I will help you. Yes, please. Ruby Light. So is that gonna 
does he randomly just heal? Oh, I, okay, so now I have more abilities. Yeah, there we go. Boom! Okay, so it's supposed to be kind of like adding stuff through the fight, but awesome. So they just gave me more and more stuff and tell you kind of re. Oh, unlock the platinum plate. Is that the ending, I'm guessing? Uh, I think I got those other ones. Yeah. Ooh, what, wait, what's that one? We gotta figure out what this one is first. Monster. Oh, I think that brings them back. Okay, so I can fight them again. Which, I'm actually just gonna go straight to the ending, but I am sure I'm gonna be playing this more and fighting them again and probably do better. This will proceed to the ending. Yeah, let's see what the ending is. Nighttime. The city of night. Okay, the car. Hey, is that your dad's car, isn't it? Now, now I get it. This is your safe place. Oh, come on. The car's the safe place? They are making a little bit too much out of this car. Like, I, I like the car, and I like the idea that they use it and stuff, but... Thanks. See you. They are making a little bit too much out of this car. I mean, they're acting like it's a whole character in it in itself. Wait, I remember your name now. Enter a name for your green guide. Uh. Uh. Dribble. There we are. His name is Dribble. The name Dribble. Congrats on completing the Platinum demo. However, Nocta's Fragment Dreamscape offers only a mere taste of what's to come. In Final Fantasy XV, you will join a grown-up Noctis and his dependable buddies on a journey across an immense and expansive world. From all the Final Fantasy team, including your favorite little mythical guide, we are looking forward to seeing you again. See you again soon! Chocobo! Would you like to order Final Fantasy XV? Uh, yeah. Oh, it's actually, so it actually just goes straight to the PlayStation Store. No, I, I'm i going to pre-order it at a later date. I was not able to get a uh, collector's edition because I didn't have the money. But I think I I do plan on getting uh, the $90 edition that's the steelbook case and comes with uh, the movie Kingsglaive. Which, like I, I said earlier, I don't know how I feel about the movie, but a purchase the game at any time by selecting. Okay, order screen. And that is the Final Fantasy 15 demo. That is the second demo we've got. Um, I think I might do another video following this uh, as kind of a comparison, talk about what's different. There was quite a bit different. Uh, it feels it feels better now. It feels different, but better. So I don't know. It's it's really it's really interesting and unique what they're able to do. Uh, with the time it has been a year since the last demo so the game has changed immensely but so thank you so much for watching if you like the video please go down below and let me know like comment subscribe and i'll see you in the next one